One dollar versus two hundred and fifty million dollar private island. This is a two hundred and fifty. Where do you find a one dollar private island at, Mr. Breast? No, no, like seriously, that don't even make sense. Where did you find like a like three grains of sand in the middle of the ocean? Million dollar private island. Literally anything you could ever want is on this private island. Naked man. I'm gonna show you. Hey, I'm up on Twitch every single Wednesday, Friday, and Sunday. Link is in the description. I better see you there. The difference between this and a $150 million luxury island, <laughs> a massive $45 million island, a $5 million frozen island, all the way down to the world's cheapest private island. Oh, uh, yep, it is three grains Tangy of sand, just like I said. Cheered. X100. I'm sorry, Father Waka, forgive me, but Mr. Breast is crazy. Yeah. How many y'all would let Mr. Breast touch yours? That thing. I'm starting to realize we might not all fit on it. <laughs> First step on my brand new island. Here's your dollar. Thank you, sir. Thank you for selling it to me. How Cheers do you even now, get buddy. that Let's land check in out what I just bought. My first like, impression like what? is it's a lot smaller than I thought. When you pay a dollar, you get a random pile of bricks, an old toilet. I found the restroom. And a bunch of random wooden Did poles. Did he grab that with his bare hands? The bricks, Did an old toilet. That? I found now nah, cocks are insane. Cocks are insane. I, I, I don't, there's no way he just grabbed that with his bare hand. That is disgusting. But I guess they're on a private island in the middle of nowhere. Everything's disgusting in general, but in the come restroom. on, bro. And a bunch of random wooden poles. There's more poles than square feet on this thing. They're actually called pylons. Let's pile onto that boat and leave. And as you can see, there's nothing here. So I'm gonna blow it up. But later in this video, we're going to a hundred and fifty million. I'm gonna let y'all know that's part of Mr. B's secret messaging. Okay, there's nothing here. That means nothing of use of him. That means he's gonna blow it up. If you're not of use to Mr. Breast, he's gonna blow you up. Trust. Island, and also a quarter billion dollar super island. But first, we're gonna head over to the one million dollar island called Monkey Island. Ooh. Yes. My people. You heard me right. This island is literally. These are my people. Get the cocks out of here. Oh, but here's my chat. Okay, I see y'all here. I see y'all here. What the hell is that? That is not a monkey. I ain't never seen a monkey look like that. I, I ain't never seen a monkey look like that, bro. Really swarmed with hundreds of monkeys. I can see why it's called Monkey Island. <laughs> What's this monkey? Oh, it's Odie. Oh, oh, Odie This is cute though. Orange. This is kind of okay. cool. Monkey seafood, monkey take. All the monkeys on this island have a strategy. Monkey seafood, monkey take. What do you mean by that, Mr. Breast? What do you mean by that? Is there in, an innuendo you're trying to throw right there? <laughs> For interacting with people. They gaslight you into thinking that you're friends, and then they steal your food. You can have it. Mr. Bress, is there any uh, innuendos you're trying to say there? I don't know, man. You're looking very suspect. <laughs> you can have it. I love this monkey. There's a monkey on the boat. And if you're wondering where you and your friends are going to sleep on this island, suspended above the water are six luxury cabanas, which house both humans and monkeys. Tangibray 1234 cheered. X100. Why aren't you there, Waka? Because I don't have the privilege of being with with a man of of such caliber as mr beast i don't deserve said privilege i'm not worthy enough okay i would i would mark up and discuss the video with my princess alone because i don't deserve it <laughs> <laughs> the monkey's grabbing the GoPro, Jimmy. Sir, we need this for filming. I just need Someone said this. W oh. representation. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, I got my camera back. You want to... Oops. Oh! Yes, oh. he wants your hat! Okay, you, you can have that, sir. By the end of this, I'm going to be naked. The monkeys are stealing everything. <laughs> and the monkeys are not even the coolest part of this island. See, this island isn't even an island at all. It's actually on top of a massive underwater plant network that emerged from the sand and water to create this illusion of an island that we see today. The f does that mean? This sounds like an island to me. Is this a million dollar island or a million dollar bush because there's no land? What you think? Oh. I don't know. <laughs> I think an island is what you make of it. <laughs> and on the other side of the island, okay, there's I even get a it. private relaxation area. So they're basically area walking on roots. Massage parlor. Nolan, I'm trying not to fall in the water. I'm about to get a massage with a monkey. That's really cool. Notice how all the water around you is freezing. What? Whoa! That took a lot of effort. And we put that much effort in to convey that the $5 million oh. island is very cool. And where we're going next, most of the year looks like this. Candy Bray 1234 cheered. X100. 
Can you sing happy birthday to my little brother Brayden, please? No. But it's going to look like this. No joke, this island is so cold right now that the lake around it is actually frozen solid. Which means to get there, we're gonna be using an interesting vehicle. We're literally hovering. Yeah, apparently. This is where like, y'all know the movie Snow Buddies? Oh man, I love Air Buds, man. I was so, it's so fantastic, man. This is where it was filmed. Apparently, snowmobiles are just too basic for this island. It just had to be hovercrafts. Awesome. Talk about arriving in fashion. And it only took about 30 seconds of being outside the hovercraft for the gang to be frozen solid. How cold is it? It's zero degrees Celsius. It's pretty cold, man. He he more like a 70 guy. <laughs> and so they so hurried over degrees. to these futuristic self-heated huts to stay warm. The only oh, degrees so that small. matter. Wait, there's no room for you in here. Uh, we're gonna have to cuddle them. And these huts are able to stay here completely year-round. Because not only can they float- I remember one time I slept in the same bed as my friend. I woke up with that nigga leg on me. I felt so homosexual. Like, not leg on me like, like he was laying like this. Leg on me like, <clears throat> like y'all know how in anime they'll be sleeping together. And then one Can't leg is like over here. Cheers. That's how it felt. X 100. A warm, peaceful lake water, but they also do just fine in the dead of winter. But at least in the winter, you get a great view of the northern lights. For five million dollars, you basically get a winter wonderland. And while staying on this island, you're given a not worth it. Five star food. I think he thinks we should as fit. as a self made billionaire, I would never buy this island. Okay, it's a waste of money. Why would I want to be in the cold? <laughs> 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 and even though this island comes with a luxury cabin to stay in. Oh, this is beautiful. This is right. Fine, I'll take it. Jimmy, buy it for me. The gang ended up spending most of their time on the frozen lake, where they were able to ride an actual dog sled. <laughs> fun fact, uh, fun fact, the, there, in the movie Air, Snow Buddies, there was like, there was multiple do dogs that died in the making of that movie. RP those pups, yeah, they, they died because of the cold temperatures. <laughs> this is the best island. I don't know how any island's gonna beat this. Maybe one where I could feel my hands. And Carl's hands are in luck because the next island is not only warm, but more expensive than all million. the other islands Let's combined. See. This island is tiny, but as a self-made billionaire, I literally have a piece of real estate just like that for $8 million, and it's not on isolated on land where none of my family members can come visit me. So that right there, that is a wasted investment. It's arguably disgusting. one of the most luxurious ones out there. Okay, let's go check it I'm out. I'm disgusted. Wow. Oh, wow. <gasps> We're stoked to have you as our guest. We hope you have a blast. Just don't break anything. Yo, we should try to break one thing. Ooh, nice bathroom. That man was Usually laughing like a monkey. people like showers that can fit like 30 to 1,000 people in them. This time, they chose a reasonable shower. <laughs> when you pay $16 million, in addition to a shower that's the size of the $1 island, the private island comes with this helicopter that's apparently too big for the island. We have jet skis. We have a submarine. Another submarine to the right. We have a shark Wait, sub hold on. They just, they just have submarines? Wait, you can just have one? I thought you had to be like a professional something to have a submarine. You can just, you can just have a submarine? How much is a submarine? On average, a submarine would be as little as $80,000 for a simple pedal-powered submarine to as much as $80 plus million for a recreational use submarine. You can get a submarine for 80K! As little? A submarine, honestly, in my mind, I think of a submarine, I think at least 1.5 mil. So yes, 80K is little. Hold up. Boys, do whatever you want. Have fun. Yeah, yeah. To get off of this thing. What is Mr. Brest gonna do when he's when he's uh third when he's like 40 or 50? Carl kissed the sea at 500 miles per hour. Is that a Lion McQueen though? To shore to take sea at 500 miles per hour. Oh, I just came. Oh my God, I think. Wait, no, give me my semen back. No, give me my semen back. That's not Light McQueen. Nope, give me my semen back. We went back to shore to take a little breather. Yeah, Ludwig's gonna jump out of a helicopter. He what? really is. No. Wait, oh, he's here? Any last words? I love you, Noah. I'm so 
This helicopter is taking the boys up into the air and letting them oh, jump really? in free fall into the ocean. Oh, really, guys? The helicopter is taking them into the air. Who would have thought that? Oh, my God. This is crazy. We shouldn't be doing this. This is only a $16 million island, and we're jumping out of helicopters. He's about to jump. Oh, my God. Well, I thought, like, of jumping, I thought hey, of someone go. accidentally jumping up and hitting the propellers. And, you know, just getting cut off. But that's... That's just my line of thinking. If money doesn't buy happiness, doesn't own that private island. Because I'm pretty happy. And now, the $45 million... My nigga, you, you bought a snake? What the hell are you gonna do with a snake? Island. This island is so big, you can't even fit it all in frame. Oh, hey! Oh, I didn't even realize they were waiting on us. I always feel uncomfortable when I pull up to places and people are... Okay. Okay, we got some black people in the video. They're all servants, though. But, hey, you know... You know, we gotta... Gotta get where we... Gotta get where we, you know? <sighs> Just standing, potentially for hours, waiting on me. <laughs> Hello! We have some blueberry smoothies here. Is it alcoholic? No, no. it is not. He's not 21. <laughs> <laughs> now we'll take you guys up and we'll show you around Royal Island a little bit. Let's see what $45 million gets us. It's a long path. The path is longer than the Lost Island. For $45 million, this island comes with a mansion and its own beachside bar and private chef. Can I give it a flip? Sure. Thank you, Tan. Outside the of the mansion is a hot tub overlooking the cove where the jet skis are. And of course, a pool with the best view I've ever seen. Does this look as cool on camera as it does in real life? And if for some reason you don't want to stay in the mansion, there's five luxury beachside cabins. You know, as we're getting more of a close up as a self made billionaire, I do think this would be worth the purchase. Yeah. I might actually take a look at this island. I might cop it like next week. It does look like a very well beautiful investment for the family and the grandkids to go to. Anna's you can pick from. Jimmy, oh, wow. may I? You may. May I? You may. I have class. <laughs> but even after messing around with all of the amenities. Why are we playing ping pong when we have an entire island? It's important to note that that's not what makes this island special. All the way on the other end of the island are century old ruins that we are yet to explore. Tips on driving. Oh no. All right, ready? Yeah! We about to fight an Elden Ring boss. What the hell is going on over here? A little bit and head to the back of the island now. How does Carl always end up driving? Because I'm awesome. Oh, big bump. Ooh, dude, this is like a safari. Yeah, you're going four times this. But like I'm in I Jumanji mean, I don't right know if now. That will stop you, but I'm just letting you know. Is there a jail on this island? No jail. Oh, there's no jail. And when we find the now, I think about it. Islands are scary. Cause if you have money for a private island, there's not just like police regulating there. You can do whatever you want on that island. Hence Epstein. Like, that is crazy to me when you think about it. Like, you have this whole piece of land, and literally no one's there to, like, relegate it. It's all yours. You get to do whatever you want. That's creepy. We ran out of road to drive on. We started to make our way through what used to be a village of people on this island over 100 years ago. This used to be a bar? Yep. Yeah, you want to walk under this 100-year-old giant 1,000-pound slab? Sure. Surely it won't fall on top of me. Dude, if today was the day that it fell, you couldn't even be mad. Nolan, come over here before you die. And just past these ruins is easily the best view on the entire island. Whoa. Ooh. Yeah, it gets better. We were driving for so long, I forgot we were on an island. <laughs> the island starts over there, comes all the way around, wraps Jesus. all the way around here, goes down that coast. Yeah, this is definitely a good investment. I'm about there. to talk I'll to my honest, financial advisor about this one. I wouldn't pay $45 million for a big jungle yeah. with some ancient ruins. I'm going to talk to my, I'm a, sure I'm a, I'm a talk guy, my guy for this one. This next island is arguably the second most expensive island that money can buy. This is the $150 million island. It comes with eight luxurious mega mansions. And the best part. Damn. Is it's completely powered by solar panels who, and wind turbines. Who it's owns these islands? Some of the most exotic animals Flamingos? I've ever seen. Is that is that King Julian? Solar panels and wind turbines. It's home to some of the most exotic. Where's Maurice? Where's Maurice? Animals I've ever seen, and took over four decades to build. This island will literally blow your four mind. Four decades. When I think of a private island. Whoever wanted to build it, aren't they just pretty much dead by the time it's built? 
What's the point of building it? This is what I think of. That's good, because this is a private island. All right. And apparently, the first thing you need to do here is wash your hands. Make sure you don't taint the island with your outside world germs. I've already washed my germs. Does everyone who come here get a coconut? I mean, they're not running low. <laughs> True. I don't know if it's because this More place is so fancy, or maybe they just heard about Carl's driving. <laughs> But each of us ended up with our own personal driver. I have a feeling this is going to be a once-in-a-lifetime experience. Unless you come back. I might be out of my price range. <laughs> and even though this island costs $150 million, I wonder how much the workers you can actually get paid. rent it for yourself. For the extremely low price of $140,000 per day. I didn't you know, I know I know a couple of YouTubers like Blu-ray. Blu-ray could afford that. He could probably afford a week. They need to, they need to hop on that. Make some make some content. Play hide Meet the side menu to play hide and seek on it. <laughs> play hide and seek w on this island. I didn't even realize we just went up a mountain. <laughs> I've heard this is the most luxurious private island in the world. It is. The view is insane. This is the great house. But before we were able to explore the great house, my dumb friends got distracted by a turtle. Oh There's God. a turtle? Get in there! Yeah! <laughs> All right, you guys go to the rest of the island. <laughs> this island is so this extra is simple that for every one person whoa, in your party. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, look at, look at all of us people coming through. This is the most black people I think I've seen in the Mr. Beast video since what? The video where he's like doing the whole world Olympic challenge? Like, golly, man, we we, we here. staff members waiting on your every need. There's a bunch of people over there like, here's drinks, here's food. What do you want to do over the next few days? And we're just like, turtle. Yeah! And of course, Nolan, of all my friends, wanted to take advantage of this. Yes, yeah! yeah! What's everyone up to over here? Oh, we're playing pool. What, 10 people? They're my hype crew. Like, you don't have to hang out with them to they make it feel good. Be. I will be sad if you don't sit down and relax. Okay. If you need attention, don't make them stand there. <laughs> it's only been an hour, but I'll say it. This is the best. That is so nasty. <laughs> Island so far. On top of all of that, the island has a house with a driving range on the roof where you can hit golf balls into the ocean because these are made of fish food. Oh, okay. I was about to say, yo, rich people are so wasteful. That is a really cool idea. Oh my god, that's that's a nice idea. I don't know, that just made me happy. Angie Bray, that just that just made me happy. I don't know why, man. You should probably hit it further so you don't hit someone. Look at all those flamingos. There's so much I can't process it. Bro, flamingos in the sky. They're everywhere. They don't love us unless we give them food. That's how it Come be. Here, my brethren. That's but literally how it be. Aren't the only exotic animals on this island. Whoa. You know how Come rich here, you brethren. have to be to see pink birds in, 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 in your life. I've never seen a pink bird fly. That that's ex I, that's either that's exclusive to tropical areas or rich nesticityism. It, it's one of the two. That's ridiculous. But flamingos aren't the only exotic. I ain't animals never seen no pink bird. Whoa, what's a dinosaur? This is Thank so you, I am cool. Dang, for the sub. Is that a believe tortoise? Believe it or not, this tortoise could live to be over 200 years old. Mr. Tortoise, my name is Jimmy. If my descendants, descendants, descendants come here, tell them I was awesome. And afterwards, we got sworn by a bunch of lemurs that live on this island. Where's, Get where's, over where's, here. where's, where's Jimmy, Maurice? I don't know if you notice that there's two lemurs on your Yeah, I know. I'm trying where's to Maurice? Move. I don't I'll put food on there. Oh, please don't. <laughs> and if you're wondering where all of these exotic animals came from, most of them, sadly, are endangered species and are on this island because the owner of Richard Branson brought all all of them here to prevent them from going extinct. Shout out my nigga Richard, man. Can we get a round of applause for Richard Branson? I like this guy. This my, this guy has a, go, a driving range that feeds fish. That is crazy. Love you, Richard, man. I like you. I like you a lot. But the most endangered animals on this island were the mermaids, mermaids? that served us sushi. Ah, mermaids and sushi. This is luxury. Mermaid. Richard sure has his taste, too. Richard, Richard sure has his taste. Lemurs, tortoise, mermaids. <laughs> Do you guys want sushi? I would say no. Is that cannibalism? Yes. It's like a family reunion. Get over here. There's honestly so much on this island, we can't even film it all. We played tennis. We played basketball. We explored yet another mansion. I did my first cold plunge. You get the idea. There's so much to do on this island, it's actually overwhelming. This one's actually pretty intense. I'm like, I I'm like this scared. island. You wanna know what else I like is Richard. Intense? What? The final island, I'll see you there. I think I'm gonna like this island more than the final island because I'm not really into amusement parks. Like, I, I don't know, they don't, they don't, 
I just, I, I, I think I'm just happy. I will be happier seeing a bunch of animals than an amusement park. But that's Why are we still here? And on the way to the $250 million island, we stopped in shark infested waters because I have to pay for this video. And now that I'm surrounded by sharks. What? And what feels like my worst nightmare. I'm gonna tell you guys about some of guys. Oh, they're so close. Oh my gosh. And the worst part is I'm not coming out until I'm done with this ad. Some of guys is a free to play mobile player game. We're 32 people. How much stumble guys pay you to, to put you in a box full of sh with sharks? With sharks outside of the box. How much? I need to know. What is stumble guys bag? Do I need to play stumble guys? Compete for the crown. You have to be an absolute maniac to do this. Not even stumble guys could pay me to do this. Why are you all here, sharks? Uh oh, uh oh. They're so close. They're so close. And for their new season, they went all out with new Mr. Beast skins, animations, and emotes. <laughs> Loki's going right up. Bro, this is wild. I want to make sure there's enough sharks for Jimmy. They also added a brand new level. You have to follow a pattern as long as possible to stay alive. And the longer you live, the harder it gets. Oh, and a shark's hitting me. I think the sharks are hitting the cave. No, it's rocking. Oh, this is scary. I also just released my brand new toolkit. So Stumble guys' is ass? Is it mid? one of their best seasons ever. You okay, so I'm not, I'm not a marine biologist. What is stopping the shark from just jumping over the cage? Because I've seen dolphins jump. You feel what I'm saying? I've seen stingrays fly. What is... What is stopping the sharks? Wait, dumbass. Now, how come dolphins can jump out of water? Like, literally... Because whales even get out of the water. They don't completely get out, but they get up enough to where they could clear a whale could clear this cage and get to jimmy so i'm just saying i i think i think if they really wanted to they could get inside this cage and i think this is very dangerous brand new toolkit so you can build your own mr beast level this is one of their best seasons ever you need to try my new mr beast level you build your own and I feel like if all those sharks started to hit the boat, they could knock, they could, they could, they could rock someone into the water. I can't, I, I just can't play with sharks, man. I can't play with sharks, bro. I can't do this. I would, my anxiety would be on 10 if I'm right here. This nigga over here playing, playing with his thumbs while sharks are outside of, like, outside the boat. No, man. Mr. Beast level. This is one of their best seasons ever. You need to try my new Mr. Beast level. Plus, build your own, and I want to see what you guys come up How with. How much do they pay you? Hitting the cage. So I'm going to get out of here. Make sure you download Stumble Guys for free so I don't have to go back to the shark cage. You're alive. Let's go do more things. I play too many games, bro. Cause, <laughs> cause what's up with a shark from flying and just snatching them from right here? Y'all know the little uh, shark game that used to be on the, uh, that you play on your phone? I forgot what the game was, but you would just eat things until you uh until, until you can level up your shark. And like I know the final shark back in my day was the megalodon, and I would have to play that game every day to get that megalodon. It was such a grind. For free, so I don't have to go back to the shark cage. You're alive. Let's go do more things that have nothing to do with sharks, please. And now that I've paid off the debt I've incurred from this video, let's visit the $250 million island. This is a $250 million private island. Okay. This extraordinary island has an entire amusement park with over a dozen water slides. It also has its own hot air balloon and just about every activity you could ever imagine. And we have it all to ourselves. There are no other guests here, but out of like every I, feature you've seen on these like islands I so said. far, this one stands above the rest. In the middle of the island is a massive water slide. Like I said, I think I like the last island better. I'm just, I'm more fond of animals and amusement parks. I like, I definitely like the last island better. This is a, uh, this is like an overload. This is too much. You feel me? You see how they have all these colors on the slide? They make you go through every, uh, every section of LGBT. <laughs> They're like, it's like everything's presenting you a choice. So first we'll show you bisexual. Then we're going to go to lesbian. And then we're <laughs> Uh, Even fault. though literal eight-year-olds ride that water slide, I might still check it out because I'm afraid of heights. But before taking on the water slide, we checked out w the LGBT other ride. Like how there's over a hundred jet skis on this island. It's a bit overkill. And not to mention, that's what I'm saying. It's just too much. That spans across man-made beaches. It's What's too much going on here. Gonna hit? The ground, bro. Because sometimes people fall off. <laughs> this is like really scary. Yeah. <laughs> Good luck. Thank you. Oh, oh, you're not far behind. This is awesome. I remember one time I went ziplining. Um, this is actually not that crazy. 
And if you own this island, you can host over 13,000 of your friends at any of these five gargantuan pools. Like, who the hell is hosting 13K? One of these billionaire Hollywood stars. Like, that's the only... you Like, this is so absurd. Um, I went ziplining with one of my friends, and he, he was, like, very skinny. Very skinny guy. So, because he was so skinny, he got stuck in the middle of the zipline. And they, we, he had to pull himself to the end of the zipline. I, that was the first time and last time I ever went ziplining, bro. Ziplining is terrifying. That nigga had to pull himself across the zipline, just staring down. That's horrifying to me. Oh, oh. this kind of looks like it was made in Minecraft. And it's so funny just seeing my two friends in it. Nolan looks like a tiny speck. For $250 million, this island, of course, has exotic Someone go animals. down the LGBT slide. Sir, I need to take you in for questioning. Sir? And even every game you can imagine. I wish there was the 13,000 people that I are think normal. he's played this game like 16 times in this video. Here <laughs> I'm to not going to lie to is that soccer pool? This island has things I didn't even know existed. That's kind of interesting. Something I noticed is that there were way too many lifeguards at this island for just the four of us. How many lifeguards are on this island? Oh, over 100. Really? With this many lifeguards, you would have to try to drown. So I thought it would be fun if we gave them all the day off. Has anyone ever rented this island before? Wow, this is a first. Dude, you are leaning back, You look way too relaxed. And after all the 100 lifeguards then, went down... Wait, they so just... what's the point of the island if no one has rented it? Um, I don't, I don't get it. So if no one's rented it, that means this is all for one person, who whoever he wants to invite. That person has too much money. Decided to hype up me it's and the public? boys for our turn. To go. Oh yes, yeah. If it's public, people would be there. <laughs> don't don't you think that if if it cruise island? Oh, okay, okay. I see what y'all mean. I see what y'all mean now. Okay. Boom, they rented it out, but normally there was going to be thousands of people there. A true size. Okay, got it, got it. Go down the slide. Yeah! Here we go! Oh! Oh, 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 my God! Boys, you want to know what's even scarier than that? What? I wonder how much it takes Why to go is it there. so terrifying? <laughs> <laughs> Uh, we can skip it. Towering at over 135 feet tall. This is the okay. tallest water slide. This is in my type of ride. North America. I don't this even is my know type of ride at. here. It's like a skyscraper. But I'm scared. Uh -huh. <laughs> Daredevil's Peak. I love what a rainbows. Soothing name. Very inviting. Oh, we're so high. It's kind of freaking me out. I'll Why probably I'd get sick of the ride by walking up there. Like I wouldn't want to go down no more. Like right to the top. Are you guys just waiting for us up here? Listen to how intense the wind is up here. Oh, don't look down. Look how crazy the island looks. That looks oh pretty. God. I'm not gonna lie. No. Oh, no one. Oh, would you say no scopes is enforceable? No scopes is enforceable. There we go. Yeah. Hey, the lifeguard said you gotta go, Nolan. I love you, mom. I'll see you on the other side. Right, Does he go. have a camera with them? Okay. No, I want to see all this. I didn't. Oh, I got hit by a truck. Let's do this! I didn't see nothing. I want to see it. Down after me. Okay. Because I'm not going there. I wouldn't dare. Oh God. Why is it so fast? Is it actually that scary? <laughs> okay, that's better. That's better. I'm going to do this for your entertainment, even though giant rides scare me. It just Here has a portable go. light? That is going so fast. And even though I was basically just drowning the entire time down the water slide, I gotta say, this whole island was pretty awesome. Oh yeah, nice. and one more thing. Make nice. sure you use this QR code to download Stumble Guys, and you can win $10,000. That's beautiful. I like that. Tanji Bray 1234 cheered. I like that. X100.